Hello there! Can you answer on the question what is the landing zone? No? So let's get in! So, what is the landing zone? Before I will answer on this question, let's review the situation. What you will spot for sure if your business will grow? You design your startup. Decision was put it on the cloud. Like an example I will show you on AWS, but it can facing to any cloud vendors. The next year step was hiring the new people on development, and you create for them the identify records to allow them to use your cloud environment. On this point everything is great and you are moving forward. Finally you got your application and first client. Congrats! But now appearing another kind of question, for example the logging of client's activity, or maybe requirement on monitoring to provide the proper performance. Ok, you got it as well, and your client's list is growing, which is great. But with the number of the clients is increasing your responsibilities. Now we need to protect more carefully your environment, to avoid any kind of attacks or hacking actions. And this makes you implement more security tools, which will help you. Each from them also requires some space for storing reports, and access to them shouldn't have everyone from the developers. You definitely still can handle it. It can be hard, because separation and segregation is not easy to handle in one single place, but still you can do this. And on the last picture, I just will ask you to think about the situation if you will grow more. More responsible teams, more applications, which some of them should be isolated from each other, and some no. More customers, which ones should also have the best performance. More internet inputs to your environment to avoid any bottleneck. More environments for your developers to have some playground before release. So what you will get in result? It will be the massive count of resources in one place. Which one will be hard to maintain right and support correct level of security? And on this stage is coming the landing zone solution. Using the landing zones, you can split up your services on the different accounts but in fact manage them from the centralized place. Like in this example, you can make different kind of accounts, which will be responsible for the specific job on your full mechanism. You can have separated account for your application, for the development and for the client's view. And if they still will use some same resources, you can easily share it between them. The same with security and logging part, you can have distinct account responsible for this. They will monitor all your activity across accounts and applications there and collect all information in one centralized place, which is secured and hidden from all. Sounds good, yeah? But this is not all. On case of segregation of duties, the landing zone helps a lot, cause you will have one place for the identification and authorization. This will give you additional layer of security and audit, but as well you can control there the permission for your team and allow use only permitted resources. On business landing zone also can help. You don't need to manage your costs for each account. In the landing zone you will have one main account, which will be responsible for this, and from there you can monitor and control your expenses. And right now I think we are ready to give the landing zone definition. Landing zone is the multi-account architecture solution. The result of this, have well-architected framework, means collect inside the latest best practice of architecture solutions. The possibility of scaling up using the free account structure. The security governments is due to centralized place of monitoring and logging. The identify management using the elastic management permission system. The flexibility to allow engineers to simplify their development process. And the business compliance because the elasticity of billing management properties. All of this is landing zone. Put the like on this video if you know what is the landing zone now. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Here was Kostya. See ya.